This demo shows the results of the last few months of work that we've done on our uh, model, uh, 3D model processing. Uh, there are several uh, areas that we want to highlight, and one is the geometric accuracy of our new calibration. A model consists of many different scans put together. And this uh, right here represents 13 scans. And when we give each scan a different color, you can see how they all uh, overlap each other. And it's important when they overlap each other like this for uh, you want to minimize the seams. And so you can see that there's 13 in here. But as you look around, you can see some seams. And we're working on minimizing them. They are smaller than they've been in the past. And that's an area that we're continuing to work on. We have some strategies that we're doing that will make these seams dis disappear. But what we've got right now, these scenes, seams are, uh, are smaller, much smaller than they used to be. We've uh, done processing to make the colors match up better. So, as I said, this is a model with uh, 13 combined scans. And we'll do a little bit of comparison just looking at two of them. So I'm going to turn the scans off and you can see parts of the model disappear. Okay, now we've got 10 left. Now we just have two, two scans. There's one. There's the other. And you can see how they fill each other in. And because of our better calibration, they're filling each other in uh, seamlessly with both geometry and we're minimizing the seams concerning the color. You can see how subtle some of these seams are right up there. We almost got the colors just right. Much better than it used to be. So that is this is where we are with our current quality. It's uh we've brought details out of the shadows better than we used to. Our geometry is more accurate, and we're getting details. Here you can see this belt right here missed by a couple of millimeters at 10 feet. So as we make our calibration better, these small errors will continue to get smaller and the result will be seams that are the same color and the same geometry. So we've got three areas that we're going to work on. First we're going to, uh, because we're com comfortable with the current design, we're going to now optimize it and make it about 20 times faster. Uh, current scans take about seven minutes and we'll get it 20 times faster. The uh, photorealism is going to be increased by merging our 
different scans together more efficiently. And that's a solved problem. But there are techniques for feathering these seams. And so we'll apply those. We'll, we'll find the right uh, uh, mix of routines that will feather this for us. And we'll make these seams disappear. And then that will make this all look like one. And then we're going to start exporting our data to other 3D apps like the Unity Game Engine, Mesh Lab, SketchUp, uh, and possibly move into um, Matterport. So, uh, and other uh, 3D commercial tools. So, that's where we are, and we expect to have this new system that's 20 times faster ready April 2016. That's it for today.